welcome to my YouTube channel. It has been entirely too long since I have filmed a vlog. So a lot has happened in the past week in my life, in the world. It has just been a little bit of a crazy time. We were skiing in Winter Park, Colorado as a family. We came home on Sunday and it is now Wednesday. My computer broke while we were out of town in Colorado. The battery in my computer started to swell and it was about to crack my trackpad. So I had to go a few days without a computer, but it is fixed now. I'm so excited and I can start uploading videos once again. As y'all just saw, I made myself some coffee, just the norm, coffee, heavy cream, and a little bit of stevia. So Cody is at work, he is enjoying his job so far, and it's just a little bit of a crazy time in the world right now. This coronavirus or COVID-19, I mean, we as a world are facing something we have never faced before. So. My brother doesn't have school for a month. We move into our house in two weeks, but at some point we've got to go to Alabama and get our stuff. So it's just a little bit of a crazy time right now in all aspects of life. But it is starting to rain as I'm sitting here by my pool, enjoying my coffee, watching the chickens. So I think I'm gonna head inside, finish my coffee, and maybe make myself look a little bit more presentable because I just rolled out of bed this morning. Our boat made it to Texas. Cody hauled it over when he drove from Alabama the other day. So we are so excited about Texas fishing. And Cooper is having a meltdown because he's locked out because he tries to eat the chickens. I know y'all have missed these cute babies. Here's little Pooper Cooper right here. He wants this stick that I have in my hand. We're trying to teach him to not look at our chickens. So trying to keep him distracted so he doesn't chase them. You ready? Go get it. And here we have Bo, great. It's Wednesday morning, right? That's the tornado siren going off. They test it every Wednesday at 9 a.m. What is that? What is that, Coop? What is that? What is that? Oh, yeah. What was that? <laughs> Well, my mom and I started off the morning at Lowe's. We went and stocked up on some plants, and I'm really excited because I got myself a couple of herbs to plant, as well as five different types of peppers, because I love peppers. So let's head outside and I can show you what I got. I got these pretty plastic pots, because they're lightweight, to plant all of my peppers in. But what I got, is this snackable red bell pepper, yellow bell pepper, what is this? Mammoth jalapeno, so the green jalapenos that I love. Over here we also got a Cubanelle sweet pepper and Big Bertha green bell peppers. I've read that peppers grow well in pots, so that's why I have five different varieties of peppers. And then over here, these are the three herbs I got. This is some sweet basil, some Italian oregano, and some cilantro. So these are going to be my little babies and I'm excited, hopefully I get to have some like homegrown veggies sooner versus later. And then somewhere over here, well, mom also got a hand washing station and she's gonna make everyone wash their hands before we go in and out of the house. And these are my pots for my herbs. All right. My mom also got a banana plant. She got some peppers, some pink flowers, and a tomato plant. And a whole lot of potting mix. So there we go. This is our Lowe's haul. And I'm so excited about my plants. It is currently 1.34 and I just realized that all I've had today is coffee. So I'm gonna go ahead and make my first meal of the day. I'm gonna start off by throwing like a tablespoon of Kerrygold butter in my hot skillet. 
And I found this bag of frozen veggies in the freezer that I don't know if my dad cut up or what. So we're just gonna throw some of those in the pan and let them start thawing, like so. My veggies are cooked, so I went ahead and scrambled two large eggs. I'm just pouring that into the bottom of my skillet. I'm gonna attempt to flip this omelet, but it is kind of thin, so it may not go as planned, but let's give it a solid try. Heck yeah, that worked fabulously. All right, so now that I flipped my omelet, I'm gonna add about three quarters of a slice of cheddar cheese. And just kind of distribute that on one half of my omelet. You know what, heck with it. We're just gonna do a whole slice of cheddar. Now I'm gonna throw on a couple of slices of ham. And fold this bad boy in half. Now I'm just gonna let it finish cooking for another minute or two and my omelet will be done. All right, guys, my first meal of the day is complete. And oh my gosh, my parents' lights in their kitchen make this food look beautiful. Look at all these lights up here. Look at that. Makes for a great, great ambiance of the food. <laughs> it looks so pretty. Anyways, this is my omelet with my veggies, my ham, and my cheddar. And I'm serving it with one of these Carb Master yogurts. I can get these in Texas at Kroger. And I believe they have four or five grams of carbs in them. Yeah, four grams. And they are so, so good. This is a strawberry banana flavor. So there we go. We have my first meal of the day. So all the dogs had their grooming appointment canceled. So they're all nice and fluffy. So they need a haircut because they are hot. So I have my dog clippers and I'm gonna attempt to give them a haircut. How am I gonna do? Probably not so well, but Salon de Salome is now open for business, right, Bo? You ready? You ready for this? He's like, oh no. Oh no, I know how this one goes. After I finished shaving the dogs, the sun came out. So I decided to lay out here and get a little bit of sun because I am so pasty, it is scary. So I thought I'd lay outside for maybe 30 minutes or so, get a little bit of sun, a little bit of vitamin D, and it feels so nice, I must say. Laying by the pool. I have been in the backyard for hours shaving the dogs. I've just been doing it in little increments, just getting what I can and then they'll run off and play and then I'll do some more. And right now our backyard, it looks like a dog exploded. Let me show you what it looks like. There is literally fur everywhere. Just wherever I could grab the dogs and get a little hair off, that's where I did it. But here we are. Bo is looking really good. Cooper still has some work to do because he can only handle so much. But we're making progress, y'all. We are making progress. Since I had a pretty late breakfast and it's looking like we're gonna have an early dinner, I decided that I wanted just a little snack to hold me over until then. So I'm going to try out this perfect keto salted caramel keto bar. And it matches my cat, so really cool. But I'm about to give this a try for a snack and I'll tell you how it tastes. Here are the macros for anyone wondering. 240 calories, 18 grams of fat, 11 grams of carbs, nine of those coming from fiber, so two net carbs and 11 grams of protein. I have to say, I am pretty impressed. They nailed the flavor on this one. Pretty good. Hey Cooper. We got a Barney in a box. What you doing, kitty cat? You enjoying this box sitting by the back door? Barney loves his boxes. Cooper, leave the kitty alone. I didn't really know what to throw together for dinner, so we're just throwing together a couple of things from the fridge. So I have some of this classic coleslaw mix, some original sausage, and I diced a little bit of onion up for now. Let's throw that in there, let that start melting. And let's pop all this in. 
Now that the sausage and onions are pretty much cooked, I am grabbing some of my coleslaw mix and going to just sprinkle a little bit of that in there. And my camera got foggy. I think that's plenty. I'm gonna add a little bit of this Slap Ya Mama seasoning into it. I'm gonna just do a little bit of that for some flavor. Mix that up and we're just gonna cook it until that coleslaw wilts a little bit. Well, I whipped together dinner in about five minutes and I have to say, this is quite tasty. Super simple as well, just three ingredients. So I'm gonna let this cool off a little bit more since I already burned myself trying it. And then I am going to dig on in for dinner. Well guys, I hope that you enjoyed today's vlog. I have missed vlogging so, so much and I'm so glad my computer is fixed so I can be back to making videos. So I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video and if you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below if you haven't done so. And remember guys, wash your hands, stay safe out there, and I will see y'all again very, very soon. Bye guys! Mm -hmm. Oh!